Mr. Speaker, this Honorable Prime Minister, this bill, Mr. Speaker, um, has met the approval of members of the House. So I this resolution, Mr. Speaker. So I move that. Been, since, since the time. Since the time. Go ahead, Prime Minister. Really? It's a speaker. Mr. Speaker, honestly, you look over at me, Mr. Speaker. You member, member, for, go with member for Miku South. Yes. You will stand when the speaker acknowledges you. I thought you acknowledged me, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker. Yes. Yes, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Member for Miku South. Yes, sir. Yes, Mr. In this Speaker. honorable house, yes, Mr. Speaker. you will stand yes, Mr. Speaker. when the speaker acknowledges Mr. Speaker, I'm you. Other member for Miku South. I looked at you and member I for my, Miku my, my, South. My, my, my God, Mr. Speaker. Member for Miku South. Mr. Speaker, you, you understand? I am not going to sit down, Mr. Speaker. Mr. I am demanding if you are not going to sit down, member, come here and represent the people from Miku South and the people of this country. That's not right, Mr. Speaker. We're coming to this house to borrow 40 million U.S. dollars, and you want to close the debate just like that? Member, and I have my speaker up. Come on, come on, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker. Even if, even if, Mr. Speaker, the member from Miku South continues to want to disrespect this one of our house. I think, Mr. Speaker, that in the interest of the people hearing the misinformation that he will utter, and the fact that I have not needed to respond, Mr. Speaker, I beg you to, even if his life came on after mine, I beg you to allow him to continue. Because there's nothing he can say there that I cannot. But Mr. this disrespect is not only right, Mr. Speaker. Has happened to every speaker in this honorable house. The member from Miku South has this has disrespected every speaker in this honorable house. One of his own speakers had to be carried out of this house after he disrespected her in his parliament. So Mr. Speaker, in this regard, I yield. Members, members, let's get let's get something straight. The chair, it's not Honorable Jeremiah, but the chair, whoever sits in the chair, runs the business of the house. Everyone in this house knows how we operate. You turn on your light and you catch the speaker's eye. There is, I looked all around, I looked again. I can confirm that I looked more than, on more than two occasions. I looked around, nobody turned on their, their lights. And there was sufficient time to turn on the lights. And then there's a cat and mouse. The Prime Minister turns on his light, and you run to turn on your light, and then we're, going, we're not going to play these games. I'm not going to accept it. I do not know which other speaker accepted it. This speaker is not going to accept it. And in an attempt to be fair, we have to take the, the, the business of this house seriously. It cannot be cat and mouse. We have young people looking at the, the proceedings happening in this house and we'd be even, we have to take the, 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 the business of this house, of this honorable house, seriously. And I'm not going to tolerate and nobody is going to say in this house when I sit in this chair that they're not going to take their sin and that you're going to proceed. This is not going to happen under my watch. Whatever action has to happen to ensure that this house is running away, that is cordial. I'm going to make sure that this house is running away, that's cordial. I'm not going to accept this from anybody, absolutely anybody. Not a member of the opposition, not a member of this government. And this is the position that I'm going to stand by. This cat and mouse and, 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 and childish game, we cannot continue like that in this house. Member, member, shame on you. Member, I'm sorry, Mr. Speaker. Okay, I put on my light, and if you don't see the importance of it, then you will be a man. And I think those are the people of Saint Lucia. But they ask you to speak. I don't think the people of Saint Lucia would ask me to speak. Come on. Thank you, Mr. Thank you, Member. Honourable Prime Minister. Forty million U.S. dollars are coming tomorrow. You don't want anybody to speak. Why don't have to act like that? Mr. Speaker, since the member from Miku, since a member from Miku South, member, you're not going to disturb. You're not going to disturb this honourable house. You're not going to disturb this honourable house. Member, member, you've disturbed the democracy. You're not going to disturb this honourable house. You've disturbed the democracy of the country. I hope you can live with it.
Member for Castries East, please continue. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, I want to make it clear for the record, Mr. Speaker, that I yielded to the member for Mikusol. I said that even if he did not put his mic on, I, even if mine was on before him, for the interest of me being able to respond to the misinformation that he will, he will utter, Mr. Speaker, I yielded. I want the record to show that I yielded for the member from Mikusov. But as usual, seeking sympathy, he refused to speak, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, I ask that members support this re resolution, Mr. Speaker, to bo this re resolution to borrow 42.7 million US dollars from the Caribbean Development Bank for recovery and resilience building policy-based loan. I thank you, Mr. Speaker.